The confirmed nominees are Stephen Ikani Ocheni from Kogi State and Suleiman Zarma Hassan from Gombe State. Stephen Ocheni was first to appear before the Senate and was asked questions by senators ranging from the indivisibility of Nigeria to youth unemployment. Being able to realize enough revenue to be able to actualize the proposals in our budget. Suleiman Zarma Hassan, who had earlier undergone similar screening as an ambassadorial nominee at the Senate committee level, was asked few questions after which he was asked to take a bow. The technology has gone further because we have real-time imageries that can even pick people who can pick density of people depending on the software that is used and the satellite imageries that are used. So I think uh, this can be used both by INEC and NPC simultaneously. Stephen Ocheni replaces Let Ocholi, who died in a car accident last year, while Suleiman Hassan replaces Amina Mohammed, who was appointed Deputy Secretary General of the United Nations. Meanwhile, the Senate has resolved that all resources misapplied by public officials from the internally displaced persons' proceeds should be retrieved and anybody found culpable should be duly prosecuted. The resolution was contained in a report of the Senate Ad Hoc Committee on Mounting Humanitarian Crisis in the Northeast submitted at Wednesday's plenary. Since it was established that Pine was paying less attention to the critical needs of IDPs in the form of housing, the bulk of the resources were used for issues that were not addressing the immediate needs of the IDPs. Outside plenary and in commemoration of the World Press Freedom Day 2017, Senate President Bukola Saraki interacted with the Senate Press Corps. I want to find out so that I can better inform Nigerians in line with what you said earlier. Uh, why, hearing from the Senate President, why is innovation is still hanging? Is that there is a process to this. And, and when I get this, I always get it from, there are always two sides of the story. I have a senator who said this is the case. I, have, so I refer to legal to give me a plan and advise me. Once they advise me on, on what is, I follow that. In the meantime, Senate PDP caucus has frowned at the detention of former governors of Jigawa State, Sule Lamido, Gabriel Susum of Benue State, and Babangida Aliu, Niger State. The caucus said it is expecting nothing less than fair hearing, otherwise the detention would not be justified. From the National Assembly, Wazir Zayan, NTA News.